What's up everyone? It's Alicia Toon. Welcome to Warriors of Wrestling's YouTube channel. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe because they post a ton of incredible content all of the time. Until next time. Hey here, New York State. Hashtag all rise. Storm saying we're in the main event, he was feeling it, and I love seeing, well, the rise of these two young gentlemen as they climb the ranks here at Warriors of Wrestling. I've been very high as a journalist on the Tello and Storm, their journey here at Warriors and beyond, the former tag team champions, and let's be real, always quality matches, always quality performances. These guys can do it all, strength, high flying, it's that chemistry between them that has made them so successful. I think a win here tonight would be huge for the Rise. Hands on their feet for the Tello and Storm. Having some words with the champ now. You know, these two men have had their encounters with Darius Carter, some singles action, some uh, opportunities as well, and some gold. But right now, we are waiting for the Six man. Last but certainly not least here, coming through the curtain at Warriors of Wrestling here at Breezy Point. The Thanos of the Northeast, former Warriors of Wrestling, World Heavyweight Champion, the man who's got a lot on his mind here, TJ Marconi. Marconi not wasting any time, going right to the ring. Like I always say, I don't know what Marconi we're gonna get night after night, he is ready to go. Marconi essentially getting that one out of the ring, standing atop the turnbuckle here. A man who uses his size and strength, but is incredibly agile as we've seen in the past. Excited to see this team up personally of him and the Rise, what they can do together. He also known for his very innovative offense. Oh, he's taking the mic from the Ferris wheel. Oh, he's got something to say. He might not be getting introductions here. Marconi just took over the formal announcements. Terry's having some words about Marconi. Obviously, we know the history between these two men. And it is beyond personal. Marconi is ready to fight. And let's be real, he wants Darius to be the first one. In that ring, Darius, as always, very methodical, taking his time getting into the ring here. Big fight feel here, ladies and gentlemen. Main event time, Marconi cannot wait any longer. The champ's going to make him win. The champion finally in the ring here. Talking to the official. Darius Carter, if you know him, if you have seen him in action, he likes to do things on his terms. But Marconi, that smirk on his face, can't wait. Carter not backing down, showing Marconi that he is the top guy right now. He's got the stats and the jewelry to prove it. Marconi directed traffic here. Carter, Marconi in the ring. We're starting out hot in this one. You know, Carter is looking for that, that technical approach here, but Marconi's trying to outpower him. And quick. Can't say I'm surprised, ladies and gentlemen. Carter right out of the ring as the Long Island landmine, former Warriors of Wrestling World Heavyweight Champion, Joe Cosio makes his way to the ring. Carter taking a breather early. Ladies and gentlemen, I am hashtag here for this. Ocasio Marconi is going to be a fight. Yeah. Having some words. I think Ocasio wants Storm. He's going to get it. I spoke too soon. We're going to have Storm versus Ocasio. 
Let's see what these two can bring to the mix. Lock up in the middle of the ring. Ocasio clearly has the strength advantage, but Storm somehow get a little bit of the edge there. I think Ocasio might be toying with him there. And he's flexing on him. He's trying to give him a free shot. Um, might not want to turn around, Joe. That is not Danny Storm. I think Ocasio just fell out the hard way as Marconi throwing Ocasio off the ropes. Big shoulder tackle. We are going to get Marconi Ocasio right now. Marconi all over the former champ. Ducking the line here. Ocasio may be looking for a German suplex. Ocasio on social media shouting out. Kurt Angle just releasing the documentary Angle. Check that out on Peacock right now. As Ocasio talking about how much Kurt Angle has inspired him as a young man. And in his career, we saw him attempt that German suplex earlier, but now Ocasio in a bad way, in a big elbow like Danny Storm. Patello and Storm doing what they do best, cutting that ring in half, quick tags. Look for double team offense, Ocasio able to power out though. Here it is, that German suplex we were talking about earlier. Picture perfect by Ocasio. Patello may be looking for a big strike here. I think Ocasio may have been able to shake it off as Dexter tagging himself in. Crowd definitely sharing their thoughts. Sidney saying, I got this. Duck of the line here for Nutella. Big forearm on Storm. Sidney's going to take a ball. Big step up knee on Nutella. And a big boot to Storm. The freshman Obsidian coming in hot. Big step up in Seguri. Got all of that one. Showing Ocasio. That's how it's done. Only one time. Tello able to shake Obsidian as Marconi back in the ring. Marconi wants to fight here tonight. Another step on me. Marconi just smirking, slaps it down. Not even rattling the big oak tree in the middle of the ring. And Obsidian now not having as much success here. Marconi just launches the former No Limits champion into the corner. Looking the arm here of Obsidian. Shoulder to shoulder. Obsidian might be done already, just the size difference here. Detello now laying into Obsidian, because I believe Detello is the legal man right here. Maybe Storm missed the tag, and Ocasio, well, creating some separation here, taking Detello out of the equation, and now Storm in a bad way. Ocasio, Ocasio in the ring, a fireman's carry, just wrong from the tall height of Marconi. Carter over the opportunist comes in. Oh my gosh! Taken out with that chop block and now Ocasio with that kick to the head of Marconi. Now Obsidian out of nowhere. Forearm to the back of the head of Storm. That's when you start to worry. When Obsidian, Ocasio, and the champion Darius Carter are all on the same page. It's trouble for the rise of Marconi right now. Going to do his best to fight out of this predicament. More kicks than the FIFA World Cup that we just saw. Storm now getting hung up on that top rope. City will find any shortcut he can. The official taking control though. He's off the rope now. Very innovative offense. I don't know what to call that. I, mean, I don't know what, know what the area code is here. Breezy, breezy point. <laughs> I'll give credit where credit's due. Very innovative offense by Obsidian. And after the finesse of that move, just a straight up, just bottom of the heel to the face. So Ocasio now may have been looking for that flying torpedo head, but Storm able to avoid it. And that's one of the most, well, one of the most impressive impactful moves I've ever seen. They were able to avoid it as Detello now laying into Ocasio out of the corner. Jump up forearm. Looking for a suplex here. He's going to get it. No Falcon Arrow. Only a two count is the 
The champion comes in to break it up, and Marconi, and right away the official has to get control here. Carter picking his spots. Just call him Cruella DeVille. Carter with a big boot on the outside. A lot of chaos in this match, we knew it would be. Personal issues between the competitors. And now we have Ocasio in the middle of the ring. He has a lot to prove. Big chop on Detello. And just a straight up right hand. I'm gonna knock this kid out. Another big chop to the chest of Detello. It's almost too easy for Ocasio. In the corner. Tell him, able to create some separation. Might have been looking for a line, but he just ate that one from Joe Ocasio. Quick tag to Darius Carter here. Taking his time. Long Island Long Line staying on that leg, twisting that ankle as Carter just onto the head and upper body of Detello and now posing for the crowd showing why he is the top guy here. Detello barely able to even crawl to the midpoint of the ring. He's not going to get there. And there's the stomp on the hands by Carter making sure he's not going to even be able to make a tag. Back to that ankle methodically picks apart his opponents night after night. It's always difficult for me to give this man praise and credit. Like I always say, the resume speaks for itself. Nobody does it with Darius Carter in the ring. Oh, and just a slap to the head. Marconi has no respect for the champion. Just slapping the head of the champion. Ocasio, though, now helping out. Being able to tag. The little things in this match. Everyone's literally picking their spots. Marconi's doing anything he can to get his hands on Carter, but in the middle of the ring, big slam by Ocasio, the Long Island land on Undertello, who has just been in a world of pain. And he seems trying to shove Go and just go slapping. Detello, Detello trying to slap, chop, fight out from his knees. He's got nothing in the big kick. Good night, kid. Good night. Marconi trying to use that size to tag. Smart play here by Marconi, but not enough. Detello now camel clutch variation here by the Long Island landmine. And this could be it. Detello could be out for all I know. This kid's taking a beating. Not taking anything of away from the heart and fight of Detello. We've seen it many times against the likes of a Darius Carter. And Detello might have something here. He's lifting up Joe Ocasio. He's got him up. Ocasio saying, no, no, no. Picture perfect German suplex. Detello's out. Mocking the fans here as the All-Father tagged in. Always proud of his uh, handiwork, we'll say, for lack of a better term, is Carter just walks over the opponent, doesn't even look at him. Showing no respect to the former tag team champion. Carter thinks he's got this one in the bag. And no! He goes for Storm, takes the cheap shot, but Marconi. Official all over the. Carter trying to get the official to keep Marconi away, and there it is! Carter taking the low road to the top with the low blow. With that knee. Very illegal knee if you ask me. I don't know how the tell is still going. Trying to slap the champion, no one home. Carter toying with him. Interesting to see this team up here. Between Darius and the Long Island landmine, it seems to be able to work together very well. I'm going to keep my eye on this. Take to the back on the Tello now. 
That was somehow able to keep fighting. Big time chop from the Long Island landline. Obsidian's coming in. He's shushing the crowd. Double chop. Oh, Detella still has some fighting him. Oh, and you can just see the pain on Detello's face. And Carter getting a cheap shit now. The, the official has no idea what's going on. Tag to the champion. Mike chants from the crowd. Carter again showing no respect to his opponent in the ring. Not even looking at him. Taunting Marconi, which I don't know if that's a great idea. You can see the lack of respect for Carter for his current opponent in the ring, Detello, right now. Taking him very lightly. Detello is beaten. He is taking the brunt of the punishment right here. Can he find a way to tag his partner? Or Marconi! It ain't gonna be anytime soon. Double stop from Carter, who again doesn't even take the time to put his eyes or any sort of respect on Detello's name. Looking down at his opponent and just stepping on the head, walking over him. That had to be incredibly painful. One hand behind the back, one hand dragging Detello to the corner, hooking the leg here. Back to Ocasio. This, again, is a very interesting team up here. These two, just keeping my eye on the little things, if you will. These two working surprisingly well together. We'll keep our eye on that. This match continues. Marconi trying to get in, not having it. Tell just being choked out of the corner. Hands behind his back. Joe saying, I didn't do nothing. Tag to the champ. Not sure Darius was asking for that tag right there, but... He's going to take great pleasure seemingly stalking his prey. The up and coming Detello. One of that leg Detello to create some separation, and it was enough. It was enough. That was enough to stop Darius Carter just creating that separation. Marconi ended a big pounce on Carter. He went flying. Another pounce on Ocasio. And a big line on the former No Limits champion, Dexter Obscenian. He's stacking them up in the corner. Big line on Carter. Marconi's going to take all three of them. Carter looking for the boot. No one home. He may be looking for a power bomb. No. Buckle bomb. But it ain't a buckle. It's Carter's tag team partners. Carter's trying to will his partners to his feet in a big body slam. Not enough in the champion. Ooh, you see Marconi hitting that knee, favoring that knee a little bit. We'll keep an eye on that. Obsidian with a running knee, and somehow almost able to get Marconi to his feet, and there's that torpedo headbutt, and that took Marconi down, and that's the move I was talking about earlier. Deadly, and that knee from the tell. The action continues here. We might have a blue thunder bomb from Danny Storm. What a match, ladies and gentlemen. Carter now. Baseball slide to Detello. Going for the leg of Marconi. Maybe a figure four here. No. Obsidian able to tag. Off the rebound from Carter into the corner. Obsidian up. Wait, wait, wait. He's caught. Marconi got him all the way up. All the way down. Chokes that by Marconi. One, two, three. That is it. Carter locking eyes with Marconi. Ovation for the rise of Marconi. Marconi taking matters into his own hands at the end of this match. Patello Baby barely able to get to his feet. I'm losing my words here. What a match that was, ladies and gentlemen. So at the end, Carter trying to get in there, break up the pinning. He was just eye to eye with Marconi during the three count. Perhaps Carter hesitated. Perhaps Carter thought twice. Maybe he didn't get there in time. I don't know, but the eyes locked between Marconi and Carter, and something tells me this is far from over between the two.
even though his team took the L, Carter still proudly holding that Warriors of Wrestling World Heavyweight Championship above his head saying, hey,